Good evening. We're in a bit of a change of location. Obviously, I'm in the kitchen. Hence, kitchen safety. Basically, I thought I would switch up today and film a video where I try and cook something I've not cooked before. I'm gonna try and do a pasta bake. To anyone else, this is probably pretty self-explanatory, probably pretty easy, but I have no idea. So that's why I'm doing it today. <laughs> also, just ignore the fact that I, I'm li this is a pajama top. You don't need to know, but I've just told you. Before we start this video, give this a big thumbs up, subscribe, and other than that, I'm gonna try, I, I don't know where to start, I don't know where to start. I tried googling like how to make a pasta bake and it would give me like two options so I asked my mum what to do and I'm just follow. I'm just gonna follow what she's told me so. So boil the pasta for six minutes and then drain. Okay, we're gonna do that. Also, I was gonna do this video because I know that I'm at uni and people a lot of the time are like, I don't know how to cook. So for all you guys and gals out there who are subscribed and don't know what they're doing, hopefully this should help you a little bit. I can't guarantee anything, <laughs> but we'll see. I also apologise for how like messy this is. I, I swear I cleaned it like yesterday, but okay. <sighs> Need the boiling. So this is the Pyrex thing that I'm using. I don't know how much pasta I'm gonna need for this because I never even know for one like bowl, so I don't know how much is. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know. Wait, I don't know like how what temperature. To, oh, I don't know what temperature. Okay, we'll say 160. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Remember the salt? Mm, but like a little. I'm using 10A, I don't know how much it's going to, I don't know, oh my god. So this is the sauce that I'm going to use, it's from Aldi. My mum said that I can use, I can put like tuna in it, but this is cheese and bacon and I don't know how well that would come across. Oh, fan 180, okay. Oh wait, it says place dry pasta. Oh wait, I don't need to cook the pasta first. Wait, I'm really confused. I don't know what to do. Do I do it my mum's way or do I follow the jar? I've done this already now, so I feel like I'm just gonna do it how my mum said. Boil it for six minutes, okay. Oh, my mum's given me different instructions, so I don't know what's going on. Oh wait, I think that the, has that helped? Not really. We have to see how much, oh my God, we can't see a bomb how much pasta I've put in. This is going to be really awkward if someone walks into my flat because first of all, the reason that I've not done this video before or like ever filmed in my kitchen before is because currently I'm the only person left in my flat. Everyone else has gone home. Um, so that's why I'm filming this now. And we've been having like security just randomly enter the flat at night. So I still don't think this is enough pasta. I've not had a bowl of pasta for a while so the fact I'm doing this, like, I can't even remember my mother. What did I just say? <laughs> I can't remember the last time I had pasta, so. This is what we do. What am I doing with my hand? Oh. I have so much ham. Um, I have to, like, crouch because my camera's not <laughs> tall enough. I got this ham from, I don't even know if you can see. It's from, like, Aldi. You get so much ham and it's, like, a pound. I've been trying to use it up, so I'll put it in. I don't know if that's going to work if I put it in this but i guess i'll just do it you might be wondering why i'm still here and that like why haven't i gone home that's kind of just because i prefer i've said this in videos before but i prefer staying at my flat even if it means that i'm alone i feel very stressed a lot of the time when i'm at home which is weird to say i guess to be honest I'm feeling a little not as great about it this time around because of whole like the lockdown thing and everything that's going on in the world. It's making it, it's kind of making everything ten times worse than it is. But for now, I'm okay being here. <laughs> it hasn't been six minutes, but I'm scared of like the pasta. Like I'm already putting water into the Pyrex, so I. 
don't want to put like you know i don't want to make it soggy i'm gonna drain my pasta <gasps> I just lost one, we lost a soldier, oh my god, it's on my leg, it's burning. This is just too chaotic, my luck. Oh, I got water on my 200 grams of pasta. Is that less or more than 200 grams of pasta? Because I feel like that's a lot. Anyway, I'm gonna put it in the pyrex. So I'm putting it, that's a lot of pasta. Like, that's a lot. <laughs> Oh no, I can't open it. No! You're joking, you're joking, you're joking, you're joking. There's a, no way. No. No, 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 no. I can't open it, I can't open it. Oh my god. For a minute, I thought. We were in trouble. I thought we were in trouble. I saw this from Aldi, but they do a bunch of like other ones. And um, obviously, when you're a student, you want to be budget friendly, you know. Fill and show water up to the top of the label and pour into the dish. Okay. I don't think it needs that much. I don't feel like it needs the whole jar because I just like, you know. Wait, I feel like I've done this wrong. Wait, I've just realised. I started following what my mum told me to do and now I've just jumped to what the jar said. So I shouldn't have put water in. Oh, <laughs> at this point. So I'm just stirring it. I think I'm just gonna see how this goes. So this is what we look like. I feel like this is too runny for what we needed. I'm too scared to put more pasta in. Because it'll like ruin the consistency of the like, you know, but I'm hoping some of this will evaporate and it will just thicken up, you know, so don't know how this is going to go. This is why like, don't switch recipes, choose one or the other. Don't start on one and then switch because you'll end up not knowing what's going on. So I'm going to put this in for, <laughs> don't know how long. Okay. We'll check on it in 20 minutes and see what happens. She's gone in the oven. I don't know what to expect because I've messed it up. Um, all right, so I've just realized, I for excuse me, I forgot to add the ham. Um, <laughs> I think I'm gonna wait 20 minutes and because like you're supposed to check it and like mix it after 20 minutes and then put it back in so I think then I'm going to put the ham in because I feel like otherwise it somehow would have like burnt I anyway so I don't know like what I'm doing half the time So it's been 20 minutes, I'm gonna take it out. Um, it looks okay. I think, I don't, I don't know, I don't know what it's supposed to look like. So um, Gemma, if you're watching this, I'm gonna use your gloves because you have two and I need two hands. So, thanks. <laughs> oh my God, I don't know how to do this. Oh my God, my God, my God, okay. I'm gonna take the fork that I've just had the whole time. I don't know if you can, can you see this? I'm gonna give it a quick mix and put it back in. This is quite, this is a uh, very watery. This is probably very wrong. <laughs> what is this? This is so weird. <laughs> Big mess. It's usually a bake, you know? There's not really much water, but that's a lot of water there, so I might have to just keep 
Good evening. I don't know. I I don't know. I don't know. Hopes. Let's keep our hopes up, children. She said it. In the morning. In the I'm nervous. She looks fine. She looks okay. Oh my god. Right. That don't look ideal. She's a bit plain. So here is she. She still looks quite plain. Oh! Oh dear. There is water. There is water. When I tipped it just then, all this water has come out from underneath. Kind of fun. The thing is, with me, I always f it up the first time, and then the next time I do it, it's fine. But I can smell weed, and I just heard someone coughing. So, I mean, it's not. Yeah, it's um, not really a bake. <laughs> this isn't really a bake. I mean, it's still pasty, you know. But this isn't really. <laughs> the worst thing in the world it's just not a bake and there we go oh wait i've not tried it i've not tried it that's in the fridge a little it's not bad it doesn't taste bad it's just not a bake you know it's just like pasta if i just cooked it normally if i'm being honest kind of anticlimactic because it literally just turned out exactly i should have put some like a bit more seasoning or something because it's very plain but i didn't think about that because i'm too stupid <laughs> anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did let me know give this a big thumbs up subscribe i might do more cooking videos in the future but just none that could go as plainly as this other than that i hope you guys have a lovely day and i'll see you in my next video